Hi everyone and welcome to the channel and welcome to the new course for version 1 of FreeCAD where we will guide you through learning FreeCAD from a beginner's perspective. In this course we will provide a basic understanding of modelling 3D objects in both the part design and part workbench environments. We will navigate through the fundamentals aiming not only to become proficient with FreeCAD but also to develop a solid understanding of how to take a real world subject and model it in the digital realm. Most tutorials shy away from this crucial concept. We will learn how to model subjects from a fundamental perspective, and a flowchart outlining the logical steps for modeling will be developed along the way. As we learn, we'll focus on using the program and basic modeling techniques, incorporating as many tools as possible while exploring each of the workbenches, primarily part design, sketcher, and later the part workbench. On my channel, this course can be found in a playlist with lessons added as we progress. If you're a Patreon, you'll gain early access to the course. This also comes along with access to the course documentation. So if you prefer your learning through textual content, then this may be the avenue for you. Just note that the document may lag behind the video lessons due to the workload involved in this course delivery. You'll notice the following version numbers for the targeted FreeCAD versions, 0.22, version 1 CR and version 1. The course originally began during the development stage of version 1, which was known as 0.22 at the time, and followed the software just before the feature freeze. There are a few earlier videos where you may notice a slight difference. For instance, the sketch now incorporates both the Quinston constraint and the point on object constraint as a single button in the toolbar. Additionally, in the UI manipulation video, the icons of the part workbench operations are seen in yellow. They are now in blue. These differences are present in earlier videos, and I plan to re-release updates to them when I have time to reshoot. You may also see the 0.22 thumbnail gradually changed to version one. I aim to update these as time allows. So what about the previous FreeCAD for Beginners course? It is still relevant and the techniques can be applied to the newest versions. I have no plans to retire the course, but if you want to purchase a copy, it can be found on my Ko-Fi shop. If I remember correctly, the course covered the development release starting with 0.20, while 0.19 was still mainstream. This continued throughout most of the 0.21 life cycle. I do plan an overhaul of the course, as the major changes in version 1 make a lot of the sketching work far more easier. CAD is a complex subject, regardless of the tools that you're using. Just remember that we all started at the beginning at some point. With myself, it was 3D Studio Max and Rhino 3D, and I transitioned to FreeCAD from those packages. My frustrations in learning the software resulted in this channel. So I wish you well in starting this journey and looking forward to seeing comments and suggestions from followers of this course. I hope you enjoy these videos and I look forward to seeing you in the first lesson. If you like what you see and you want to donate to the channel, then you can do so via Ko-Fi or Coffee at ko-fi.com forward slash m-a-n-g-0 or via paypal at paypal.com forward slash paypal me forward slash darren b e stone i also run a patreon where you can get early access and additional content and that's at patreon.com forward slash mango jelly solutions links can be found in the channel header on the about page or in the descriptions of these videos I thank everybody that's donated so far. It really helps to keep the lights on so I can produce more content and also expand the channel. Thank you for liking, commenting and subscribing to these videos and I hope to see you again in the next one.